Yep. Arca runs on the dirt too. Are you ready for that? I'm ready. I mean, uh, I've been on the dirt uh, first time I was four years old, but it was in a motocross. And then, uh, I mean, uh, of course, uh, hope we're going to be doing some testing, hopefully. But um, it's going to be another thing I have to learn. So I have a lot of a lot of uh, experience to gain this year. But it should be a fun thing. I mean, I've been on the dirt before, uh, not with an Arca car, but uh, other experience, and I, I truly enjoy it. I think. Um, so can you talk about being a female in male-dominated sports? Yeah. Um, you know, like I grew up in a male-dominated uh, sport since I'm, I'm a kid. My brother was almost 10 years old more than me, and I was surrounded by guy my whole life. So, uh, I mean, you have to step your foot on the ground and uh, just kind of show those boys that we are here and that the car doesn't know if you're a girl or a boy, you know. And, I mean, it, it, it's their fun because we're just, you know, like this this uh, race right there with like two of us, you know, and it's easy to difference us from other drivers all the time, so I'm sure like we bring a lot of attention, but you know, like until people get used to it, I mean, I'm sure it's going to be like that way pretty soon. And how did this deal with VR12 come about? Who approached who first and, and why do you think it's a good uh, combination? Um, I started working with Tony Mark Racing through Dodge. Actually, Dodge uh, introduced me to Tony Marks for the, the season this year. And then uh, we had really good chemistry with the team. And uh, we just talked further. And then I was able to meet VR12. And I think VR12, uh, being green, being, you know, like a, a vitamin, like to, for saving the, being green, to, you know, I think it's an amazing match together. I really think of VR12 as a responsible company. Yeah, I think it's great to have them on board and then um, we just match pretty good. So can you talk a little bit about your racing background, just everything you've done and then how this is different from any of that? Yes, uh, well I'm coming from a background of motorcycle, my dad, my brother, my dad was racing flat oval race when he was younger on the dirt and then uh, being on the racetrack really young. And I started riding motocross at the age of four, and then local race, and being involved in motocross. And then later on, my dad is like, you have to stay in four wheels. And I started seeing my brother a pretty bad crash. And then I was like, okay, that's a good idea. So I started riding, like, uh, not riding, but doing more uh, school carts, a lot of go-karting and karting and karting. And then I got involved in Formula Car in 2004. And I've been running a uh, car like Star Mazda, Skip Barber, all the development series. I went to England and China for Formula Renault, and then uh, last year, Alexander Tagliani from Fast Race Team, I was a development driver over there, introduced me to the stock car and asked me to drive his car, and then on the road course, because he was busy in the Indy car, and uh, I convinced me, and I quite enjoyed it way too much, so <laughs> I, I, uh, I had the opportunity to meet Tony Mark Racing afterward, and here we are.